Here you go. If you want a great natural uh, windscreen or privacy hedge, Angela, you've got some great ideas with grasses. You bet, Mark. You know, grasses, you know, they've been used in landscape for quite some for years now. For a long time, now. yeah. And every year, you know, they've been getting some new ones. Uh, some are for different uses. Some of the more dwarfs kind of use more for around a, a flowering bed. But look at this. This yeah. is going to grow like eight feet tall. Right, exactly. Now, this, you know, this is really great to use for a screen. It's great to use for... You know, an area where you just the, you want to kind of see wind movement. Right, uh, and correct. if you don't want them that tall, again, you got your nice texture, but a dwarf grass. Uh, you know, very dwarf. You know, you got your blood grass over here. This gives you a lot of color, and you can see the color is extremely vibrant. And I can even go to the variegated. Look you at go that. Go to the variegated. Now, you know, be careful. Some of these uh, could be invasive. So, if, you know, areas where you're very sensitive to them, you know, check it out. Make sure. You no, know, none of these are. None of these varieties are. But always be careful on sure. you know, checking the varieties that they are. But you know, a lot of different heights, a lot of different textures. They're great for you know to extend an area, extend a bed, uh, for privacy, and uh, just great color and great interest all year, and just nice movement. Plus, you don't have to paint them like a fence. That's yes, that's true.